Wait till you see this pretty girl and how sweet she is. Look at her. This is eggnog. We're calling her eggs for short. Just look at her. <laughs> am, I, am I boring you? She's such a sweetheart. She's probably a year at the most. So we may be about 10 to, 10 to 12 months old. And uh, a good Samaritan brought her in. She was just sitting out in her yard. She kind of lives in a more rural area. And, I mean, there are houses around, but it's, they're far apart. So anyway, she was, this woman was just sitting in her yard, one of the nice days we had about a week ago. And this girl just came up to her and jumped in her lap. Just jumped in her lap. So we've been look, trying to find her owner for about a week now. We have her all over uh, Facebook and everywhere, and nobody has claimed her. So we're going to put her up for adoption. We don't want her to live in a cage and too much longer, so we want to find a home for her. But she is what we call buff-colored, so which is a little bit more unusual for a female. Plus, it's a little bit more of an unusual color to begin with. So she's very unique, and she is sweet as pie. I mean, look, <laughs> she doesn't even know me. I met her once when I took her picture when she was brought in for a split second, and I just picked her up out of her cage and brought her in this room so I could get some pictures and video of her and just look at her. I mean, she's only been in here 10 minutes. She's very friendly, so she is a, she's a very well-adjusted cat. She doesn't need a lot of time to adjust to new things. Um, she's never been scared since she's been in here. She doesn't like being in the cage, but who would? You know, so I don't know what her story is. Somebody obviously owned her at some point because she's very social. We don't know if she's spayed yet, so we have to check for that. If she's not spayed, she will have to get spayed. But I wanted to start advertising her now. And look at that cute tail. It's kind of lighter on the edge. Because I need to line up a home for her. So she doesn't have to stay in a cage anymore. You can tell she's young. She's just not quite maybe a year old. But very social. Um, she does well with kids. We don't know about other cats because she's been in a cage. Um, that's the only thing. But, you know, most cats when they meet need need an adjustment period anyway. Did you see? <laughs> so she's kind of been exploring this room here. Um, she's very curious. But like I said, if you're looking for just a friendly, loving little girl, very pretty little girl, um, I think you should look no further than Eggnog. She is just, she's just a dream. I mean, she's just the sweetest little thing. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.